Hello, you guys! Welcome back to being live in my basement. Um, I hope you weren't expecting Finn or Lenny, because Finn is out for a walk and Lenny is uh, <laughs> kicked out of the room. So, today is uh, November 1st. How, how, how is it already November 1st? Are you guys all confused by this? I feel like November, I mean October, was just gone. So, that means it's a fresh start, it's a new beginning, and that's exciting. So please, get your mat. I assume you already have it, because you knew we were starting at nine. So, get your mat, come on back, have your water close by. If you didn't grab a pillow, grab a pillow, we might use it today. I say my, I'm not 100% sure. You can grab your, uh, your water. I've got some lemon water here. My favorite thing to drink in the morning. And it's so good for your body. And with that, you guys, I hope we are ready to begin. So go ahead and start your watches if you're into that kind of thing. Come on down to the floor. You know, why don't we just use that pillow already? So bring it under your hips. Sit up as tall as you want. You can cross your legs. Or you can stack one in front of the other, lifting your hips a little higher. And then when you're ready, just uh, get yourself nice and comfortable. And sit up tall, hands in your lap, spine nice and long. Go ahead and close your eyes. I want you to take a big inhale in through the nose. Exhale, press it out through the mouth. Inhale, breathe it in. Exhale, press it out. This time, get your hands involved. Inhale, pull it all in. Exhale, press it out. One more in. And out. Press it all away, right? New beginnings. Get rid of the old stuff. You can replace it with whatever word you want there. Bring a big smile onto your lips. It's November 1st. Might as well smile. You have the entire month to change everything that is going on in your life. Anything that you are not happy with, today's a new beginning. You make that goal, you take those actions, and you do you, right? So again, take a big inhale in through the nose. Exhale, let it go. Inhale, bring that left hand to your heart, right hand to your belly. As we breathe, I want you to go ahead and really just lift through your entire front body. So big breath in. Hold it at the top. And exhale, release. Inhale. Exhale. Relax your shoulders down. Inhale. Exhale. Relax through your face. Inhale. Exhale. Release that tension. Just keep that breath going. And if you notice your mind starts to wander as we breathe, just start counting the breath. One on the inhale. Two on the exhale. Three. Four. Keep it going until you get to 10. Great job. You can bring your hands down to your lap, open your eyes, or you can just follow my voice, whatever is comfortable for you here. Take a big breath and lift those arms all the way up. Look towards the ceiling, big stretch here. And exhale, float your hands down to your mat, tuck your chin right into your chest, feel the lengthening through the back of your neck. <clears throat> Inhale, lift those arms, look up. And exhale, chin to chest. One more, in. And out. Great job. Inhale, arms go all the way up. This time we're gonna interlace our fingers. Turn your palms towards the ceiling. Big stretch again here. Really feel yourself lifting even taller through your upper body. And on an exhale, release your hands to the base of your neck here. Open your elbows wide. Take a big breath in. And exhale. Inhale, look up. Really send those shoulders towards one another into the middle of 
up your spine. And as we exhale, we're gonna tuck our chin to our chest, release your elbows forward, and start to round through your spine like you're pulling your upper back towards the wall behind you. And just allow your chin to come to your chest. No pulling, no straining, just let gravity do its job here. Really finding that length from the base of your neck all the way down your back. Inhale, slow and controlled, roll up from your tailbone. Open your elbows wide, look up one more time, big stretch. And exhale, round, chin to chest, back goes towards the wall behind you, elbows come forward. Inhale, lengthen, opening all the way up. And exhale, round. Inhale, roll it all the way up, and then open your arms wide, find a stretch that feels good. Maybe you spin through your wrists, find a pull left and right. Just opening up through that upper body. And then give me a shoulder roll. Inhale, lift those shoulders up to your ears. Exhale, loop them back and down your spine. Inhale, and exhale. One more, in and out. Great job. You can go ahead and move that pillow aside for now. We might use it again later, who knows. And when you're ready, we're gonna come onto all fours. Bring your knees directly under your hips your wrists directly under your shoulders. Spread your fingertips nice and wide here. And really press into your hands. You can feel your upper body lifting away from the mat. If you're arching in your low back, really flatten it out, nice straight line here. And you can choose to curl your toes under or keep the tops of your feet flat onto the ground. Your choice always. So take a big breath in. Exhale through the mouth, let it go. Inhale. I want you to drop your belly, lift your hips, send your gaze forward. Exhale through the mouth, rounding through. Chin to chest, upper back goes towards the ceiling. Really press into your hands here. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, round. Inhale. And exhale. Keep that going. I know it might feel weird to send all of your breath out, but that's how we get all of this energy out of our body and really start to bring in that new energy, new beginning, because it is November 1st, you guys. We'll do two more. And last one. Great job. Come into that neutral tabletop position here. I want you to really press into that left hand and inhale, send your right fingertips forward, spread your fingers nice and wide, and when you're ready, slow and controlled, we're gonna send that left leg back, point through your toes, and try to lift your arm, lift your leg so you're parallel to the ground here. Take a big breath in, and out. Just really feel your body finding that balance. Take another breath in. And on an exhale, connect elbow to knee in the center, slow and controlled. And if you wobble, that's okay. Inhale, extend. Exhale, connect. One more, in and out. Great, plant that knee, plant that right hand down. We're gonna go on to the opposite side here. Inhale, left fingertips come forward, spread those fingertips nice and wide. Press into that right hand to find that stability. And when you're ready, send your right toes back. Nice straight line, focus on your balance. Take that huge breath in. And on an exhale, connect elbow to knee right into the center. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, connect. Inhale. And exhale, release it down. Great job. Go ahead, open your knees as wide as your mat. Release the tops of your feet down. Bring those big toes in the touch. And then I want you to walk that right hand underneath of your nose. Take a big breath in and out. Inhale, open that left arm all the way up to the ceiling here. Focusing on that breathing. Take your tailbone, tuck it under. And if this is too much on your shoulders, you can always bring your fingertips down to your shoulder cap 
or even down onto your hip. Just rotate your chest towards the sky and pull that top shoulder blade back behind you. Focus on your breathing. Big inhale. Exhale, let it go. One more, just like that. In. Out. Great. Inhale at the top. Exhale, tap that left hand down to meet your right. Inhale, resist on the way up. Exhale, tap it down. Inhale. Exhale. One more. Inhale, resist it up. And exhale, tap it down. We're going to plant that left hand. Inhale, open up the right. Holding it at the top for two breaths. Last one. Great job. Big breath in. Exhale, tap it down. Inhale, resist it up. Exhale, in. Last one, resist it up. Great job. Go ahead and come back into that neutral tabletop position. All fours here. Curl your toes under. Take a big breath in. Press into your hands. Exhale. Inhale, begin to slowly send your hips towards the ceiling, coming into our first downward facing dog. You can have your knees bent, your heels lifted if you would like. Really press into all 10 fingers here and slow and controlled, release your chest towards your thighs. Take a big breath in and out. Feel your shoulder blades falling down the back. And with that next inhale, bend your knees, look to the front of your mat, step or walk all the way up, bringing your feet about hip distance apart, and then when you're ready, release that upper body over your lower body, get a nice big bend here in your knees, opening up through that low back, and when you're ready, tuck your chin into your chest, forward fold. Holding it here for just a moment, maybe taking opposite hand, to opposite elbow, even finding a sway left to right. Always find what feels good for you. And then come back to center, release your arms down. Inhale, glide your hands up to your thighs, straighten through your legs, straighten through that upper body like you're a figure seven. Take a big breath in. And exhale, fold. Inhale, lifting into our halfway lift. And exhale, fold. With that next inhale, we're going to come all the way up to standing, rolling up through that back. Inhale, lift those shoulders up to your ears. Exhale, loop them back and down. Bring your hands right at your hips. I want you to walk your feet in towards one another, bringing big toes into touch, heels into touch. And then really press into all sides of your feet here, standing up nice and tall. Take a big breath in. And out. Great. Inhale. Bend your knees. Drop your hands down. Draw a big circle as you stand all the way back up. Slight back bend at the top. And exhale. Forward fold. Inhale. Lengthen. Halfway lift. Exhale. Fold. Plant those palms down on the mat, angling your fingers towards the corners of your mat, and then step one foot back and the other, coming into a plank. Shift your body weight forward so your wrists are directly under your shoulders, and press into your hands, lifting away from the floor. Take a big breath in. And on an exhale, keep those elbows into your side. We're going to slowly lower down as we move through our first vinyasa. Belly comes to the mat, uncurl your toes. Inhale, press in your hands, lift your entire upper body away from the floor. Squeeze your glutes, let your shoulder blades release down your back here. Take a big breath in. And on an exhale, we're going to send it back into a child's pose. Opening your knees all the way up as wide as your mat. And then bringing your hips to your heels. Arms stay extended overhead. And when you're ready, slow and controlled. Release your forehead all the way down to the mat. Close your eyes. Take a big breath in through the nose. Exhale, let it go through the mouth. Inhale. Exhale, let it go. One more, just like that. In. 
and release. Great. Just let that breath come in and out through the nose in a normal rhythm. You can take a drink of your water if you need to. Or just use this moment to surrender. Begin envisioning what you want November to look like. What goals do you have for yourself? What things can you acknowledge are already going right? They're in alignment to help you get to that next step. Right now, I want you to say an I am phrase to yourself, one that you wish someone would say to you. So say it to yourself. I am strong. I am confident. I am brave. I am successful. I am healthy. Any one of those phrases might resonate with you. Just repeat it a few times now in your head or out loud. Bring a big smile onto your lips. And I want you to think of one thing that you're grateful for from today. And with your next inhale, come all the way up to our tabletop position. Knees under your hips, wrists under your shoulders. Go ahead and curl those toes under and then take a big breath in. Exhale, sit yourself all the way up, down your facing dog. Trying to release your heels a little closer to the mat this time. Taking some of that bend out of your knees so we can lengthen through the back sides of our legs. Really pressing into all 10 fingers here and sink your chest towards your thighs. Take a big breath in. Exhale, release your shoulder blades down your back. One more breath here. Great, bend those knees, look forward. Step or walk all the way to the front of your mat. Come into that forward fold. Inhale, lengthen, halfway lift. And exhale, fold. Inhale, bend those knees, big circle, all the way up. Slight back bend at the top. Exhale, palms together. Bring your hands to your heart. Take a breath in. And out. Great. Go ahead and step to the center of your mat, opening your legs pretty wide and angling your toes towards the corner here. Take a big breath in and open your arms all the way up like you're a giant star. Lengthen through your fingers here. Take a big breath. And on an exhale, we're going to send our hips back and come into our forward fold. Hands come forward to kiss the ground. Head releases. Chin tucks into your chest. Press into those fingertips. Inhale, lengthen, halfway lift. Nice flat back here. And exhale, fold. Inhale, lengthen, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. One more. Inhale, lengthen, halfway lift. Hold it here. I want you to bring that left hand under your nose. Inhale, open that right arm all the way up to the sky. You can play around, maybe bouncing from one side to the other, bending a knee, leaning to one side. Just find a motion that feels good for you. Or stay right here and don't move. Just breathe. One more big breath in. And exhale, release that right hand down. Plant it onto the floor. Inhale, open up that left arm. And again, maybe you find a bounce side to side. Do what feels right for your body. And don't forget to breathe. Inhale. And exhale. One more breath here. In. And exhale, release that arm down. Tuck your chin into your chest. I want you to bend your knees, bring your hands onto your hips, slow and controlled, roll all the way up to standing. Keep it going, open those arms all the way up, look up, and exhale, palms together. 
bring them to your heart. Take a breath in and out. Great job. I want you to turn your toes to the right side of your mat. So right toes face the top edge, and then we're going to pivot onto the back of that back foot, lifting through your heel. You can walk your feet forward if you need to to open up that stance or keep a small stance if you don't have quite the ability to reach long. Take a big breath in, turn your chest to the front of the mat, and then lift those arms up and overhead. And as we exhale, slow and controlled, we're going to sink in our hips here, bending in that front knee, keeping this front knee over that front ankle. Inhaling in and out. Inhale, lengthen all the way up, press into that front foot, come all the way back up to standing, look up, exhale, sink it down, this time lower your elbows at the same time, so we're making like this cactus shape with our arms. Inhale, all the way up, exhale, lower, inhale, exhale, one more, in, and as we exhale this time, we're going to bring our hands all the way to the mat. Plant those palms, step it back, move through your vinyasa. Inhaling into our up dog. And exhale, you can take child's pose or come into a downward facing dog. Find what's comfortable for you. And wherever you land, close your eyes. Take a big breath in through the nose, out through the mouth. Inhale. Exhale, one more, just like that, in, release, great, let that breath come to a normal rhythm, in and out through your nose. You can repeat your I am statement in your head or out loud. Bring a big smile on your lips. And I want you to think of a second thing that you're grateful for from today, but this time be a little more specific. Visualize it behind your eyes. Remember the whole experience. When you're ready, find your float all the way up to our downward facing dog. Lifting those hips high, sinking your heels a little closer to the mat, press into all ten fingers here, and release your shoulder blades down your back. Take a big breath in, and out. Inhale, bend those knees, look forward, step or walk all the way to the front of your mat. Inhale, lengthen, halfway lift, and exhale, fold. Bend those knees, big circle, all the way up. Swipe back and at the top, and exhale, hands to your heart. Take a breath in and out. Great job. Turn to the center of your mat. Open your feet wide again. And when we're ready, arms go up. Exhale. Forward fold. Inhale, lengthen, half the left. And exhale, fold. Bend those knees, hands come onto your hip. Come all the way up to standing, arms go up again. Interlace your fingers. Turn your palms towards the ceiling, big stretch. And exhale, just release your hands behind your back. Interlace your fingers. You can bring the palms together or keep them wide. And when you're ready, press your knuckles towards your mat. Really roll your shoulders so they're open. Shoulder blades come into your spine. And then lift your chest. Look up. Slow and controlled. Bend those knees. Start to send your hips back. Coming into our halfway lift. Keeping that bind if it's comfortable. If not, release. Hold it here. Take a big breath in. And exhale, release, forward fold, keeping that bind. One more big breath in. 
and exhale, slowly release your hands down. Inhale, lengthen, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Great job. Inhale, lengthen, halfway lift. Hands come to your hips. Roll all the way up to standing. And we're going to turn to the left side this time. So toes point to the front. We're going to rotate on that back foot, coming onto the ball here, lifting through your heel. Turn your chest so it's parallel to the front of your mat. And when you're ready, lift through your arms. Really lengthen through your leg here. And exhale, slow and controlled. Release it down. Drop those elbows. Inhale, lifting. Exhale, lower. In. And out. Two more. Last one. Great job. Bring those hands down to the mat. Plant those palms. Step your foot back. Move through your vinyasa. And exhale. Sit it back. Child's pose. I'm going to hang out here for two breaths. Inhaling in. And out. And one more. Great job. Inhale, find your flow all the way up to your downward facing dog. Take a big breath in. Exhale, bend your knees, look forward. Step or walk all the way to the front of your mat. Forward fold. Inhale, lengthen all the way up this time. Arms overhead. Exhale, palms to the center. Take a breath in and out. Go ahead and step to the center of your mat one more time. You guys are going to love being right here in the center. <laughs> this time I want you to keep your uh, feet right about in line with your hips here. You can figure out if you want your toes pointed forward or slightly at an angle. Whenever you find that foot position, sweep those arms all the way up. Bring your palms together. And as we exhale, we're going to slow and control. Begin to lower into a squat, bringing your elbows into your knees. Now, if you need to keep your hips up here, that's okay. Just keep that chest lifted. Otherwise, continue sinking down into that squat. Really press those elbows into your knees. Press your knees into your elbows. And just find a position that feels good. Maybe it's stillness. Maybe you start to kind of find a little lock side to side. You could try to lift one heel and then the other. Just again, playing around with what feels good. Focus on that breath, big belly breath. Exhale, let it go. One more, in and out. Great job. Go ahead and release that left hand down by the left foot. Really press your elbow into your thigh and then open that right arm all the way up to the sky. Really feeling that twist in your upper body. Inhale. Exhale. Keep that chest lifted. Spread those right fingers nice and wide. And on an exhale, release the right hand down to the right foot. Open up that left arm. Focus on that breath. Big inhale. Exhale. Notice if you started to sink forward. Really lengthen through your spine here. One more breath in. And on an exhale, release both hands to the center and lift your hips all the way up, coming into our forward fold. Point those toes forward, tuck your chin into your chest. And just breathe for a moment. Inhale, press your fingertips into the ground, halfway lift. And as we exhale, we're going to walk ourselves to the right side of our mat. Plant those palms, step it back, move through your vinyasa. And when you're ready, send it back into your child's pose. This time, try to keep your knees into the center. Walk yourself back. Hips come to your heels. And you might find that it's a little tight as you release your upper body over your lower body. Just use your breath to help guide yourself down. Take a big breath in. Exhale, begin to release towards the floor. You can stack your fists one on top of another and just rest your forehead there. Continuing those big breaths. 
Really visualize the back side of your body lifting instead of the front. And release one hand at a time. Bringing your forehead all the way down to the mat if that's available. And then walk your hands back by your feet, opening your palms towards the sky and really allowing your body to release here. Shoulders roll forward, eyes close. Take a big breath in through the mouth and out. Inhale through the nose, out through the mouth. One more, in and out. Great, just let that breath come in and out through the nose in a normal rhythm. Bring a big smile onto your lips. And I want you to think of one more thing that you're grateful for from today. And with that next inhale, bring your hands under your shoulders and begin to press your upper body away from the floor. Sitting up nice and tall, hips come to your heels. If this is too much pressure on your knees, you can lift yourself up, place that pillow right in between your thighs and your calves here. That's going to open up a little more space for your knees. Sit up tall, bring those hands right down at your sides by your hips. Take that right hand to your chin and just glide your chin to that back wall like you're making a really cute double chin, you guys. Holding it there, take a big breath in. Exhale, release your chin forward. Finding that extra extension here. Inhale, pull it back. Exhale, release it forward. Inhale. Exhale. One more, in. And out. Great. Go ahead and bring your body weight forward. Hands come to the mat. Curl your toes under here. And when you're ready, we're going to again walk our hips back to our heels, really feeling that deep stretch through the bottom of your feet. And if this is too much pressure, you can always just lift your hips up and away just slightly, getting a really deep stretch through the bottoms of our feet right now. Focus on that breath in and out. Inhale, sweep those arms all the way up. Exhale, release that left arm down. Lean over to the left just slightly. Focusing on that breath. Inhale, all the way back up to center, arms overhead. Exhale, release that right arm down. Lean to the right. Inhale, back to center. Exhale, release your hands down. Bring them forward. Uncurl your toes, send your feet to one side or the other. We're gonna extend our legs long in front of us. Shift your body weight so you're into the middle of your mat. And then move the flush of your buttocks from one side to the other so we can really come onto our sit bones and sit up nice and tall here. Bring your hands by your hips, planting those palms into the mat. Flex your, te your, your feet, not your teeth, <laughs> in towards your face. And rotate those big toes in towards one another, feeling that whole leg starting to engage. Sit up tall, tall as you sit up all day. Exhale, let it go. Inhale, sweep those arms all the way up. And as we exhale, I want you to bend only at your hips and just start to fold forward. You release your hands down. I'd rather you have a straight back here than a rounded back just to reach your feet. So nice and long through the spine. Walk your hands as far forward as you can and just hold it there. Take a big breath in. 
Exhale, see if you can bend a little bit farther forward. If not, do not press it, don't strain. All of this comes with time. The more you show up, the more you work on yourself, the more you will notice all of the wonderful benefits. Take another big breath in. And exhale, release. Sitting up nice and tall, send those arms up and overhead. And as we exhale, slow and controlled, release that upper body all the way down. Send those arms over your head, get a big stretch here. And as we exhale, pull your knees into your chest, catch your shins with your hands, and give them a little tug. Lift that tailbone away from the ground. And just take a moment here, right in the center. Inhale. Exhale. Great, bring your palms together right in front of your chest. And we're gonna send our fingers through our knees here. Catch the outside edges of your feet. And when you're ready, send the bottoms of your feet to the ceiling in your happy baby pose. Just allow the weight of your arms to pull your legs towards the ground here. You can stay right here in stillness if you'd like. Maybe you want to find a little rock side to side. Find what's comfortable for you here. A little massage through your spine. Maybe you want to play around with where you're holding on your feet. You can take your peace fingers Wrap them around your big toes. You can bring your hands to the inner arches. Just have a moment to just have fun. Maybe send a leg straight, bending the other. Just playing around here. No judgment. Free of fear. Free of anxiety. Just being right here, right now. And then when you're ready, Wherever you are, find that stillness. Take a big breath in. Exhale, release the bottoms of your feet together and bring them to the center of your mat. Your hands are gonna come right into your hip creases. Take a big breath in. And as we exhale, press firmly into the tops of your thighs. You'll feel a little release in your low back here. Take a big breath in, release those hands. And exhale, press. Inhale, release, and exhale. One more, just like that, in, and out. Great job. Take your hands to the outside edges of your thighs, pull your knees into the center, and then bring them into your chest. One last time, give them a tug. Holding it here in the center, take a big breath in, and on an exhale, release one leg and then the other. Allow your hands to fall open to the floor, palms open up to the ceiling, feet go as wide as you may. You guys made it all the way to the end of our practice. So take a really big breath in. And exhale, just let yourself sink into your mat. Inhale. Exhale. And again, this is our time to just be still, be present, notice what's going on around you, the sounds, the smells, the emotions, the thoughts. And if you're thinking, start to count your breath. One on the inhale, two on the exhale, three, four. Keep that going.
with that next breath, go ahead and wiggle your toes, your fingers, bat your eyelashes open and close. And then when you're ready, bring your forehead, <laughs> bring your hands together up to your forehead. Close your eyes, take a big breath in. And out. Be kind in your thoughts to yourself and others. Bring your hands down, your lips. Inhale. Exhale. Be kind in your words to yourself and others. And bring your hands down to your heart center. Take a big breath in. And out. Be kind in your actions to yourself and others. Take one more big breath in. And exhale, let it go. Namaste. Slow and control, come all the way up to a seat. And I hope you guys have a really fantastic first day of November. Remember, you guys are in control of what you want this month to look like. So set your goals, take actions, and truly be kind through every single thing to yourself first. And you'll notice a huge shift all month long. So I look forward to seeing you guys in person real soon. If you need more of this, go join my group, Catching Waves Yoga. We'll be live on Thursday and then hopefully in person with you guys next Sunday. So hope to see you guys very soon. Bye.